Derrida Isle here. Welcome back to the long, dark road to 500 days on Interloper. We are at uh, Transfer Pass. Been here for a couple days. Um, starting to establish a bit of a base here as we are going to be um, heading to explore those new areas that I've never been to. So we will pretty much blind. Um, day 75. And it is nighttime. Uh, it's not quite the mm, proper time to sleep, unfortunately. Um, so, and I don't have uh, the condition to go do a dump on anything. Um, so, I think to pass some time and get some tiredness gone, we'll just break some of the stuff down that's inside. Um, this will give us two hours and it will burn some calories, but that is life. And it will help tire us out a bit. So, I think we do that. Um, amazingly dark in here. Yeah, I'm gonna see if we get yeah, there's our bedroll. Okay. Uh, now I think we will. If we have enough food in us. We'll drink some water and then we'll sleep. And we've really gotta hope we can find a deer in this zone. We need I really want to get some food established. If I can't find one though, um, then I'm gonna have to go to new zones to explore. Um, it is what it is. So let's try sleeping. Um, we probably won't sleep as much as I would like to, simply because I'm not that tired. I should have burned off more energy when I was out and about yesterday. Um, here we go. Yeah, we're waking up. We definitely, um, and so lovely. That's lovely. Yeah, we caught, we got four rabbits yesterday, but see, rabbits is just, they produce so little meat that, um, it, it's really not viable to, uh, hunt rabbits and, and keep yourself full. And we have pretty much harvested, I would say, all the cattail in this zone as well. This is ridiculous, but at least it's nighttime. Pretty much got all the cattail. Um, we won't be able to do very much right now. Uh, my tools don't really need sharpening. We'll do a little bit. It's still too dark to see. Yeah, and I don't think I have any craftables that I can... No, not really. Um, I doubt that it's uh, even close to being able to repair anything. Too dark, yep. Yeah. So, kind of limited in what we can do right now. And if I could stumble around and find something to break down, that would be good. Maybe we'll do this. We'll just quickly pop our lantern on. I didn't want to use it very much. My fuel's getting low. I don't have any fuel or a way to get any. Um, I think in here, though, we have a chair. Okay, so we will uh, kill a little bit of time if it will let us. And it probably won't. Too dark. Yeah. I don't think we can break down harvest stuff uh, in the dark. Yep, you can. Okay, good. I hate wasting. I hate passing time. I hate wasting time. Um, see if I can find that uh, chair again. See if we break this down. Still no. Okay, then we will break down this T-shirt. Yeah, I hate passing time and wasting time, even in these types of situations. So we'll get that one broken down. A little more cloth. I still think it's too dark to, uh, to, oh my. There it is. I had it. Nope, I've lost it again. One way to pass time trying to find objects in the dark. Unbelievable. Now I'm probably looking at the ceiling. There it is. I keep finding it and I'm missing it. Wow. I must be just nicking a corner of it. Not the main part. There. Nope, still too dark. I guess we are going to be forced into simply... Let's try and pass a little bit. Let's have about that. Still not enough. Okay, there should be good. Yeah. 
Okay, so that's, um... Now we can kind of see. I can, uh... I'm gonna drop my reclaimed wood about here. I have a bunch on me. Again, I'm, I love building up firewood. Having lots available. If those guts cure... You know, I don't have a workbench, so it's not like I can... That's the one thing this place doesn't have a workbench, which makes sense, but if this zone had a workbench, this would be awesome. Um, but unfortunately, it doesn't, so... And now we're just stuck in the waiting game. Yeah, without a workbench, I can't even make rabbit traps. I assume in one of the other zones, there will be those, so there's always that option. But for now, that's just not going to happen. Not an option. Um... I need to get a deer. Let's try and sleep for now. Probably could have done two hours. Nope, an hour was good. Okay, at least it's light out now, but clearly we are working with a uh, noisy blizzard. It's not fun. Not gonna help us. Uh, this broom can be broken down. Just looking for everything that's gonna let me. Uh, these shelves are. Uh, this is ugly. I'm just gonna break it down simply just to break it down. Because that'll clean the place up. I got all this shelf space now. Um. This is a nice, it is really nice. You can really get organized. I wish I could get rid of that plant. But there's these open shelves. You can really organize things up. Which is what I'm going to do because uh, I literally can't do anything right now. With that blizzard going. So what we're going to do is we're going to actually organize up our shelves here. With uh, drinks. Keep two of these on us. Keep one coffee on us always, and one green tea. And the rest of these, see, we can, um, I'll put them up top. We can organize up our, our, our new home. I wish I'd let you, let you place these things tighter. That's looking nice. No, 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 no. Hey, why can't I get this one so close and the other one I couldn't get that close? So weird. We'll put our burdock down here. They're only going to be able to get one per. That's a Rishi. It can go here. Another burdock. And our tea. Beauty. And. What perfect timing. Look how organized we are. Place is starting to really shape up into a nice home. Okay, it's going to be freezing outside. Yes, it is. So, again, we don't know where deer spawn, so the only thing we can do is run around looking for them. Um, and they can spawn at any time. But we are still going to have to eat. I'm still going to try and maintain my... Uh, I'm still going to try and maintain and get back to my well-fed buff. Um, I hate that I lost it. There's no point in losing it if you're trying to maintain it. Now, it is cold. Conditions high. So what I want to do is go out and scout about a bit. Did we go up there and have a look? I think we did. Okay, there's those partum partum and part of. Do they get scared? Like, will they get spooked by me? They don't appear to... Oh, yeah, they do. They do. They get running. Okay, so I bet you can nail these things with stones. Yeah, he's... I can get about this close. Can I hit this thing? 
Not stone. I can. Uh, same as the rabbit. You have to actually decide to kill it. Okay. Now, did they run? Like, they, did they vanish, vanish when I, did, when I scared them? That'll suck if they do. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we went up there and we saw that it went nowhere. Okay. So... seems like they they took off like like when they took off they took off and took flight and so i i i really uh i can't feel my hands yeah okay well that kind of sucks so they're not a very good source of food and so you never know where they're going to be and uh you probably can only get one or two of rocks lucky i even hit one of them i'm not sure if i go back in a couple of minutes if they'll if the three of them will have returned or if it's kind of like a one-shot deal so we're already freezing doesn't matter um we want to i am gonna just jog a bit because i can always sleep to get some back and warm up do the sleep warm sleep you know sleep and warm up allowing you to use your stamina more effectively um are you having some sprints on the go Again, I'm just kind of having a search. See if there's any deer that have popped up anywhere. What is, it? is that a rabbit over there? That is. We will definitely take that out. Where'd he go? There he is. Okay, so there's another rabbit spawn south of our depot. Right here. That's about far enough. Last episode, I was learning how to hit rabbits, and I was getting a little bit better at it. These ones are really passive. They tend to sit do nothing for a while, so I think I can get them from here. I think it's right like this. Missed. Okay. But rabbits tend to not run away very far, so then you can get another opportunity. Okay, that worked. Is there another one around? Because they usually come in pairs of two. Yep. Wait, is this acorn? This is the acorns I already found. That's right. Okay, so we got, we're going to get this one as well. And then we're going to return home with this. Warm up. If you'll stop. Why are these... Oh, I can search for acorns. Okay, right on. Where'd he go? What the... I hear him. There he is. Get our stone out. Oh, he stopped moving. Perfect. Okay. Oh, no, he started moving again. Stop moving, rabbit. Maybe I can get him like this. Oh, good shot. I'm getting better. Getting better. Okay, that's good. Let's, um... Eat one of those. Take my rock. Let's uh, sprint back home. Grab any sticks we see, though, of course. Okay, so we know we have a, we have three rabbit spawns very close to us, which is uh, fantastic. I just want to see a deer wandering about. That would be so awesome. And it's always, it's about learning where they spawn too. Like, because once I know where they spawn from, those just have to be flying overhead. 
Once I know where they spawn from, it's going to be easy to go check the spot. Uh, their spawn points and just, uh, you know, to look for them. I think we'll just go straight to fire. Uh, the sooner we get this food into us, the better. Got confused there for a minute. Uh, of course, we won't be able to do a magnifying glass, so we will blow a match. It's amazing though. Four rabbits. Right. And it was in the afternoon yesterday. I actually cooked them all up and ate them. Didn't even well, I know I was chopping down stuff new spray, but didn't really even last me, you know, twenty four hours. Add this and four sticks. Oops. Um gonna see, will this get me warm enough to do it? Should I go grab a log? Not going to be enough. We will grab a uh, feeder. And if I don't fall yeah, up. we'll get that on there. That should give us uh, hopefully some temperature. Okay, that's fine. So let's go with this and see what this is all about. So we can get 1.1 kilograms off of it. So it's similar to a, uh, it's similar to a, uh, uh, whatchamacallit. Um, we can do this. Our calories will still be okay. Again, we're trying to build up the well-fed buff, so we can't let that hit zero. Um, now we can, uh, we'll drop the bigger one. And let's just get that going. 27 minutes. If we go with, uh, we might as well cook this one as well, actually, because it'll cook really fast. Three minutes, wait on it, grab it, let's eat that. It's not very much. It's only 55, but it's going to help us stave off that uh, for a bit. And now if we go into our rabbit and we look at what will one kilogram take, 21 minutes, 88 versus 128, we will do that. And with that, we will drop this and get that on there. And this is ready. Perfect. This is going to provide us with 563 for one kilogram. It's not bad, honestly. One kilogram of, of the bird gives us that. And we can harvest this one. Oh, that's 0.1. We can harvest this one. And, oh, that's good. We have another full one off there. We'll do that. No deer, but it's at least getting somewhere. This one can get on there. This one can get eaten. So what's a rabbit give us? 560. So it's, five, it's the exact same. So a full one kilogram is 563 off these things. Okay. Um, so while that's cooking, I might as well. That one's got nothing on it. Um, this has 0.1. I should have just harvest that in the first place. Three minutes. Okay, so we're good with that. We'll put this on. It's going to take four minutes. We're going to grab it. We're going to eat it. 81, not bad. A little bit. Drink. Drink to about there. There's 11 minutes on this. We'll, uh, we'll just pass on that and we'll get it. So that's our breakfast. Now we got to think about lunch. All right, so we will uh, do water. 
There's no reason to never do water when we've got a fact of fire, unless we have food to cook. We're going to get the water going. We've got lots of time on this. Um, what we'll need is a warming drink. Okay, so that'll, that'll work out well. Okay, so we can actually, um, uh, we can work on our, uh, maybe I should stay as close as possible. We can work on our, here, here's a trick. We go in the vehicle, same. Doesn't help going in, okay. So anyway, we can, we can harvest this one down and get these feathers off of it. What the? What the? Are you kidding me? Okay, there is never any reason you would do that. That I have to change that. That's ridiculous. You would never ever. Why did you just go find a corpse to pick feathers up? There is no reason to do that. Wow. That should take five minutes per feather. Think about that. You're getting feathers off of it. You're not getting... <laughs> oh my god. It's so dumb. Uh, it's hilarious, honestly. Do I want the hide? Not really. I think we'd just rather the guts. Let's just do this. It'll help us warm up a bit and wait for the water to be done. All right, so and now we're just gonna drop these things. Oh, oh no, I'm a level five harvesting master. Um that is good. And we'll just drop uh these here for now what does that mean level five what do you get at level five carcass harvesting 50 percent reduction 100 percent by hand and 30 percent on hide or gut harvesting times cool that is nice um i think we will just do another water we don't know if it'll uh-oh we got something kicking up um, we're going to take our tea and drink it. And now we can... Uh, it, wow, it's a co really cold in this zone. Um, really cold. Uh, I think we're just going to go and uh, explore again some more. Um, hit up a few more... Uh, rabbits if we happen to come across some uh, mostly though I want to go and figure out if I can find a deer somewhere I'm, I'm itching to go to the new zones for sure but I need to know that I've got fallback for food But if I don't find a deer soon, then I'm really not going to have a choice. Got a wind in my face, unfortunately. And not knowing where they spawn really forces me to kind of just randomly wander around, hoping that I stumble into one. But at least I'll get sticks while I'm doing it, because there was a blizzard last night, so should be fresh sticks everywhere. I mean, this looks like where you'd expect them to put a deer. It's kind of secluded, it's open. You know, yeah, I'm not saying that there is, but it does feel like if they were, if I was designing the map, I would, I don't know, maybe it's a little close to the, to the homestead to, to have a deer spawn, but I feel like this would be a deer area.
But until I start to figure out where they spawn, I'm definitely going to be checking this little area a lot. It just it's wide open enough. It just feels like there would be a deer spawn here. Anyhow, if nothing else, I'm getting more firewood um, built up. And that is a very good thing. Very good. The best thing. As well as I think I'm heading towards the rabbit spawn. I don't know how long it takes for them after you kill them to come back. Is it daily or... Is it like... Take more time or... I think they were up this way. Maybe it was... Uh, I had to go and wrap around a bit up here. Yeah, maybe there was a cutaway or something. I'm trying to remember. Or is this the... This is, says mine site. Yeah, this is to the zone. Right? So... I'm going to go have a look. See what zone it is. Okay, so this is a zone of contamination. Um, I think I'm going to have a peek around a bit. Just in case there's like a deer sitting somewhere on this side of the map just waiting for me. Um, but I will definitely have a quick look. I'm not going to get too seriously into this, I don't think. Um, I'm getting cold and there's a wind blowing. It feels like a blizzard's cup. Whoa! Whoa, whoa, we're out of here. Goodbye. Goodbye. Yeah, that is... No thanks. Now, I do know um, very little about this zone. However, because I've watched uh, videos... Um, I don't think I have anything that smells on me. I watch videos on how to handle wolves that other creators have made. Um... And one of them covered all the wolf types in the game. So they did talk about poison wolves. And that those wolves are only found in the zone of contamination. And because there's definitely no rabbits. They were spawned along this road and they're not back yet. So it does not, they don't come back immediately. They must take a certain amount of time. Yeah, so because I am aware of poison wolves. Um, nice wind. That means that. I know about them and they are very dangerous and that's why when I saw those wolves I knew since there's only poison wolves in the zone of contamination I knew immediately that I had to back off because you know if they were normal wolves I wouldn't have even cared um, poison wolves are extremely aggressive they have a very high scent range and detection range much higher than normal wolves in fact, I'm surprised that that wolf didn't see me from that distance and start coming towards me. And they they are not afraid of torches and flares. So that's the primary problem. You, you can only ward them off by free chucking stones at them. Um, so like w without aiming. So you won't force a charge. You can throw stones at them. Um, and if you hit them, it'll, it'll cause them to run a bit, but not very much, not like a normal wolf. They will run a little bit. Um, and so the idea is, is that if you are, see one that's getting a little bit onto you, you would free throw stones, hit it. It would sort of back off for a quick second. And during that time, you would run away from it. And then by the time it sort of gets out of that panic mode, which takes like three seconds, um, it has lost vision on you or has lost the interest in you and, and cannot detect you. This fire is not even warm enough to get me warm. Now the water did burn off. There's 19 minutes left on it. Um, so we will cook water um, and hope that it actually finishes. And just, you know, because uh, the timing might work out where the water gets done. Um, there seems to be a storm coming in. Let's, yep. Here we go. Here we go. Boom. There's another reason why I wasn't staying in that zone because of uh, the fact that it was um, starting to blow up a bit. And I I'm not getting caught in a zone. I don't know. Uh, 
that I'm not getting caught in a zone that I'm not uh, familiar with. Um, and in a blizzard, that would just be uh, crazy. Certainly if I knew the zone, going back now with a blizzard and going to wherever I was trying to get to would be a good idea because now all the predators are despawned and there will be none. So you could travel safely if you could run through the blizzard. Mm. The problem with that is, number one, I don't know the zone. I don't know where I'm going. And number two is your clothing would take damage from that blizzard. And that's not always that's not a very good idea at all. So um, anyhow, we have wood that we collected there. We've managed to get another 15 sticks. And we don't need these tinders. Put that in our garbage room. And we are now back to this situation. You know what? Let's, uh, I'm going to break this down. We're back in our situation where we are stuck inside. There is nothing else in the toilet room to break down. So I think we'll just close this door. Kind of ugly. Um, I think we've broken down just about everything in this place. And I think we'll put our cloth, um, we can just use this as a, yeah, we have a bunch of torch, oh, bad torches in here. Right, in case we do ever need them desperately and they're available, let's put our cloth in here. That's for all. Actually, um, I forgot. Maybe I can do some repairs while I'm sitting around waiting. Yeah. So I definitely have some repairs to do. Maybe another brutal night because I'm not tired. Uh, we'll be happy when those hides and guts are done or mitts need to be done. Everything else is uh, doing great. So we're not worried about these can be repaired. And this hat can be repaired. Now it's good to tune up some of our stuff. Um, anything else that's uh, sus? Yeah, this jacket. Oh, my combat pants will actually provide quite a bit of benefit by getting it repaired. And definitely this thing. I think that's kind of it for now. I mean, I could do these. I like to wait till they 80% 80, 80 before I do them. Um, so I think I'll let those go. And I would say that we can drink. All right. And we do have four backup waters. We're just, we're not really building the water up. Uh, probably I'd have to do an indoor, an indoor one to, what we will do though is we're going to rip out here real fast. Then we can get these things. And I will take all this because uh, it'll give us something to do instead of just passing time for, for stupidity reasons. Right. Okay, so here's where all our stuff is. Um, we can drop like this. And... I think we can go into this and uh, do some more harvesting. Let's take a gut off by hand. Don't know if you can harvest in the dark. That would be interesting to know, actually, because that's an excellent way to kill time if you can. I can't remember. I think maybe you can harvest in the dark. Uh, we can drop these. Let's find out. Because I, I am not ready to sleep. Apparently you can, it seems like. That's good. So I'm going to save all my harvesting of rabbits. For the night time. When I, when I am, when I, like, unless I have to harvest, like, it's just like I'm doing now. Like, I wasn't going to harvest these feathers because they take so long, but because I need to kill time and I'm not tired enough, I'm just going to do it.
Because then by the time I sleep, uh, I'll make it to morning. And we've got that all cleaned up now. We can drop this. And I assume now we have some feathers. Wait a minute. If I harvested the feathers, where are the feathers? What, am I blind? Why didn't I get the feathers? God, I need anything right about now. Okay. That seems like a bad deal that I just spent that much time harvesting the feathers and I didn't get any. And I'm a level five skill. What, what, what gives of that? Oh, how am I in this room? Wandering around looking for my bed. There's a door. There's a bunch of my sticks. I think I'm against that bench. Unbelievable. I can't even find my way around. That's why I wanted to be able to break that benches down. Can't even find my bearskin roll in the dark. I'm still at the sticks. So I assume I have to go this way, turn this way, walk along here. And sort of, there's the water bottles. The bearskin should be somewhere. Like I'm right at the water bottles. How am I not finding my bed? There it is. There's a suitcase. Suitcase. I just had it. There we go. Okay, so we'll need to eat. And unfortunately, like we're still chewing into our food supplies. We are not able to get a steady state of... Uh, of food, so we are going to probably have to push into a zone if we can't find a deer tomorrow. If I want my well-fed buff, we will. We will probably have to push into a zone. I don't know if we'll find necessarily find food, but uh, um, I also have to consider the zone of contamination is a weird zone, right? Like it's supposed to be contaminated. The wolves, the reason that they're so aggressive is number one, they're contaminated, but number two, they're, they're all scrawny and they're very aggressive because they're so hungry. That indicates to me that there's maybe no game that spawns in that zone. I'm going to look that up, actually, because if that's the case, I need to go to one of the other zones. So I got a bag of deer one way or another. If there's no deer, rabbit, etc. in that zone of contamination, it's only going to be the food that I find. Um, just something about the whole concept of zone of contamination it sounds like it's a place that you're not living off the land very easily. Anyways, let's sleep. Well, think about it. I still want to... I know that it's it's on the right up about the zone. I know deer spawn on this map. Well, we took it very close on the food. That, that goes, so... Um, I think we're just going to keep eating cattails, but we are very close to having to make some some uh, moves if we want to keep maintaining our well-fed buff. We're going to have to make some moves here. So everything is looking okay. It's very... Uh, it's not that early. It's not bad. I can tell already it's freezing cold. There's wind blowing. So, but I have to go out and spot check for deer. And I think we are going to sprint around a bit. And if we find anything else as well, rabbit spawnings, things like that. Then we are going to, um, of course, sprinting is, no, I don't think sprinting burns more calories than, than walking. Maybe it does. We're having just a real quick run around. See if 
we can spot anything. Oh, there's some rose hips that I have not harvested yet. Can we spot anything? Because otherwise I should probably prepare to go to a different zone. I can't feel my feet. Oh, also, the, and then the other thing is the wolves. Oh, there's a cat tail I missed. The wolves don't have uh, meat on them in Zone of Contamination. Those poison wolves, they are devoid of meat. So it's not like I can go and kill wolves for meat, because if I could, I, I definitely would do that. Okay, we're in a blizzard. I don't want to stay in it. I don't want my clothes to be taking condition loss. So we are returning back immediately. The weather is in this zone is quite nasty. This zone... Feels like it has Pleasant Valley level of uh, weather settings. In my opinion, I feel like it's a Pleasant Valley uh, level of uh, cold settings. Wow, it's just, you know, think about all the blizzards I've been getting. It's been very, very, very nasty. Um, I will just keep on dropping my, my sticks. Jeez, it's so loud, too. Wait a minute. What was that? What is this? Oh, so I did get... This is Feathers Hard from Parking. I'm used for crafting and gear improvements. Uh -huh. What do you mean, gear improvements? Actions. Nothing. What? Four out of five, and needs cloth. Warms the core when equipped. Improved insulation. Okay. Okay. Um, obviously, we need to get some more partamatigans. Parta if I close this door, will it be quiet? Good. Okay, let's store that stuff then. So, it was here. Okay, um, we can store the acorns, we can store the cloth. I'm carrying a newspaper for some reason. And go here in the garbage room. All right. So we have a blizzard, um, and we are once again we are we may lose our well-fed buff. Uh, we may end up have, having real food issues. Honestly, well, we'll never starve. But, you know, we'll never have the. Like a real problem with it. I'm gonna sleep for an hour. Try and pass this blizzard. Yeah, it's just, it's gonna be a real nasty go. It's gonna be a nasty go. I've never been so hungry in my life. How are we doing over here with all our stuff? Not, not organize this. It's, unfortunately, I just don't have anything I can do right now, um, in particular. So, I feel like I want to organize things. I think we'll do it like this. We're going to drop... We'll drop our fur and our cedar. And then we'll step and we'll drop our recycled. And then we'll step and we'll drop uh, seven coal. 
That's a little bit more where I can grab what I want when I want to. I will break down this metal pail. Is a, I think that it's the last thing we can break down in this place. Yep. No, we definitely got this place a little bit cleaned up. Um, and what's that? Yeah, that in there. Okay. Clean up our garbage torches. That's all of them. Managed to get one in the rear corner somehow. Just trying to kill time and watching my food very carefully uh, so that I know that I go and eat some more of my meager cattail supply. Can't even go and hunt anything right now. Don't want to lose my buff. I may be forced into it. I may be staying here too long now. So I think if I'm going to go anywhere, I'm going to have to go to that forsaken airfield zone. I really just, I don't know though. Maybe I want to go to the zone of contamination. Like it looks like there's stuff there. Like when you get in, there's like a rail track and a road to follow. I just feel like maybe it'll lead somewhere. That doesn't mean that I'm gonna. It's gonna lead the food though. Like just finding, even if I find buildings or building, it doesn't mean we're gonna find food. So, and it, whatever we do, it's gonna be very limited. I'm gonna burn through it very fast. So, I don't necessarily feel that going like unless it was like a village or something. I don't think there's gonna be a village, but I know it's a very large zone, like a like a Milton style city. Even then, whatever food I'm gonna find, I'm gonna be burning through it just by exploring. Um, it doesn't seem like right now the best option for getting established. Um, it feels... I better eat. That was crazy to do that one. It feels like I need to nail a deer. Or at this point, even a wolf. Honestly. You know, and to take down a wolf and get some meat off of it. There was a wolf that's been so far in that tunnel. Because on the other side of that entrance tunnel I came in, there is a wolf. There was a wolf there. Uh, he followed me for a while when I was coming in, but he might not be there anymore, and it's a long haul. So even if I go into Forsaken Air, that's the thing. If I go into the zone of contamination, I can't kill a wolf to get meat. But if I go into the Forsaken Airfield, I can kill wolves for meat. Um, uh, so I think that's probably the plan. I'm going to try once more for finding a deer in this zone. I want to have one more. Hopefully this blizzard is going to break. And I want to get one more good run around it. Look again. For a deer. It's been a couple days. If I nail one deer, it'll it'll set me up properly. Probably eat more of these. We're getting very low in them. And the other thing too is I, I doubt that there's a lot of cattails. Maybe there's cattails in the contamination zone. But you'd think that there should be sparse resources due to the fact it's contaminated. Right? So, I feel like, yeah, I feel like that Forsaken Air Filter, what's the name of the other one? Um, immutable something or other. I don't even know where the entrances are. I, I definitely know where the entrance to uh, Zone of Contamination is, and I definitely know where the entrance to Forsaken Air Fields. I believe I do. It's, it seems like it, it was the sign was pointing that way. Um, I don't know about the I know nothing about the other zone. I don't I can't even remember the name. Immutable something or another in, incredible. Uh, a, I don't know anything about it. Um Forsaken Airfield sounds like it would have like I assume it's like a military base, therefore I expect to find shelter. So, you know, the other one could it's like I just don't want to get myself into uh, like a Ash Canyon situation where there's like literally one place you can stay in the entire zone. And the other place name sounded kind of bleak as well. And I don't know. So um gonna have to think about it. But right now I'm trying to wait for this blizzard to end. I guess I can sleep again. I don't like doing that. Be 
Dealing with blizzards in the long dark is the most difficult part of the game. Because they are the one thing you can really do very little about. You have no control over. They're, it's completely random as to how it functions. Um, and no matter what you're doing, if a blizzard suddenly comes upon you at certain points, it can completely alter your plans. And blizzards to me are more challenging to deal with than any predator in the game or any situation in the game. They're more challenging to deal with because the, the complete random nature, how brutal they are, um, and how quickly one can come in out of nowhere in a specific scenario and cause you to be going from everything is going your way and into everything is now no longer going my way. Um, like if I was had traveled in the zone of contamination and was halfway down a road and didn't know where I was going and this kicked in, I could be in serious trouble very quickly. Because I would not know uh, if you're far away from shelter or you can't find shelter. The other classic thing is in a blizzard, you can, you can get twisted up in one and suddenly be lost. Just by happening as you're walking to jerk your mouse too fast and suddenly you're in a fort and it oh, doesn't make sense anymore. Which way was I going? It doesn't make, or on like coastal highway in the middle of the, of the, of the ice, you, you know, it's like, which way was I going? And now you just have to walk in one direction and hope that, that you can figure out where you are. So blizzards are to me the most dangerous part of the game and they're what makes the game fun. But it really sucks when this happens. And you are stuck. I don't know if this counts as an outdoor, indoor, like I wonder if, like I've been outside so much it wouldn't even be showing yet, but... I'm wondering if, uh, like, I am, am I indoors or outdoors right now? Like, is cabin fever even a thing when you're in here? Because there's no load screen. And, like, I know it's going to be technically classes indoors because if I try this, right, I can't do that. Um, but would cabin fever build? Probably. I, I, I think it would. I think it does. By me staying here. It doesn't matter. I spent so much time outside. Um, I, I, I'm not worried about cabin fever. And there is a cave nearby if, I, if it did happen, so I'm not worried about it. All right, I'm going to real pa fast pause for you guys. Uh, slow run for me. I, I'm going to go make a coffee and think about uh, what to do as soon as this blizzard kicks because I have to make decisions. All right, so... Thought about it while I made a coffee, and I think that going to Forsaken Airfield is the plan. Um, we'll be bringing that and some coal. Um, I think that is the plan. And the idea is uh, to go there and hopefully uh, either find um, a safe spot. can't believe I have to break into my water. Uh, find a safe spot or... Um, or find food that we can grab and bring back here. Or find food that we can grab and take to somewhere safe there. Um, but the main thing is to hunt something. And if it has to be a wolf, it will be a wolf. Obviously, if it's a bear, they even better. But uh, if it has to be a wolf, it will be a wolf. And if it has to be multiple wolves, it will be. The other thing, though, is, is as I head the Forsaken Airfield, if I see a deer in this zone, then that will change the plan. Right now, I have no choice but to, and because I am going to travel, um, it's getting late, though. If this blizzard lets up soon, then we'll go. I don't like night traveling into a place I've never been. That's uh, nonsensical. God, we have, we're so well stocked, like... You know, I say all oh, my water's getting low. At any moment, I can make a huge fire and just brew up a ton um, of water. Even inside, I could be doing that, but I don't want to. Um, so it really depends on this blizzard. If this blizzard would would break down, um, we would be good. Is there anything I can do to pass time? Do I have, and I, that's brewing, brewing, brewing. This is dressing. Oh, I should have some of this on me. I always, oh, I, I, because there's no wolves. That's why I'm not, uh, uh bringing any, but, um, yeah, I am going into a zone where there is some. Um, so we should prepare ourselves for moving. 
Though that if we suddenly decide to, uh, we will definitely bring one more water. Uh, we will bring, I say, one of those and uh, the Rishi. We'll bring that with us. Uh, just some extra drinks, right? Um, yeah, so that's good. We got like five drinks prepared on us. Um, we are still slowly working our way through our cattails. Um, all of this would go with us. These torches, we got a few more we can still get rid of. Even this one will break down. Just finding little odd jobs to do. While we wait for that blizzard, we will start breaking down these things. Um, oh, if that blizzard doesn't stop, oh my god. Not the end of the world if I lose my well fed buff. It's just that I feel like I'm probably getting like. I'm probably but uh, very close to it kicking back in again. It's been a couple days so far that I've been making sure I don't get hungry. I think we'll end up keeping the rest of the torches. Let me see. We've got. Um, hmm. That's about the right amount. Drop more of this wood off. We roll, we're gonna take two more coal with us. Um, and that's pretty much it. That's like, we're ready to roll. Just double check everything. I brought my drinks. Nothing in here that I care about. Um, yeah, this is all fine. So yeah, I just need this blizzard to stop. Did I sleep again? It's so stupid to do that. I think I'm going to, though. I'll be up. All, oh, finally, finally. Thank God. Okay, so in the interest that we may, despite the time of the day, that we may end up rolling hard out of here. Um... We're going to bring the bear roll. It is freezing in this zone. You, we did not get nice weather in this zone. So we're going to head out. Um, find it going towards where that place was. And. But also hoping we find a deer. We'll go for a little bit and then we'll have to start a fire and warm up drinks and stuff. There's nothing that I see moving. Not particularly happy about, uh, no, I just jump up on this ridge. Just make sure there's not a deer hiding over here and there's not at this point it's it's unbelievable to say this but i would absolutely love if, i'm definitely going to take it out there's no question, because I don't care if I smell, because I actually want wolves to come to me. Okay, um, let me get this going. But I also would just rip the meat off of it and then when I make my fire and cook it up. Why is it running so fast away from me? Stupid thing. Oh, there it is. There it is. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Let's, uh... Let's get this. Oh my god, I missed it. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. How did I miss it at point blank range? Ridiculous. Can I get it from here? Oh, I almost got it. There's two of them too. Oh my god. Okay. 
incoming. How did I miss that close? It's so precise. Unreal. Me and my hunting rabbit skills leave a lot to be desired. How did that not hit? I mean, I swear I hit it. Nope. Nope. Okay. Oh, I didn't have it out. God damn it. There you go. I need these rabbits. Where'd the other one go? Right there. That's right, come to me. Quick, quick, quick. Perfect. All right, so now when I have my fire to warm up, I've got to, uh, I've got a purpose in life. I am gonna travel a little bit more. Also, I'm just assuming this road was the way to the zone. I'm pretty sure it was. Go oh, a little bit more. I'm not, I mean, I'm losing a little bit of condition, but I'm pretty full, so condition-wise, I think I'll get another stone. That bird's flying. Yep, so leave. Okay, so here's the new zone. I'm assuming this is the airfield. Yep, it is. Okay, so the weather here is frightful. This looks like a good little spot for a fire. We got a lot of coverage. Um, there's a lot of little nooks and crannies. I think I'm moving down the road just a bit. There we go. Here's somewhere where uh, uh, it would make sense to throw a fire down, and we found a bunch of sticks, too. Right, this little place looks like we got some... Uh, this will be a great little spot for a fire right here. So let's uh, light a torch. Let's put it right here. Oh man, I could have used a magnifying glass. Who would have thought? Who would have thought that that, that was a waste of a match? I gotta remember to check that. It, its conditions look terrible. It looked overcast. I never would have thought my magnifying glass would work. Okay, unless I was looking at it wrong. We are gonna need to do, we'll do the sticks, but we're gonna need a coal on there to get the uh, temperature up to where we need it. Um, we better eat another cattail. We are getting dangerously low. Okay, uh, we are warming up. Let's put this out. And actually, that's all fine. Let's get into this. Let's get it done. Harvest, we're gonna get the, uh, we're just gonna get it all off uh, by hand. No, we need to do it quickly. So we'll do it like this. All right, and then we need to do the other one. Got 0.8 on it, okay. Gotta throw our drink down too. Get some drinks warmed up. Okay, so let's uh, let's quickly uh, get these things. That's the one kg, drop that one, and the 0.82 will drop, and let's get those cooking. 
Okay, that's going on. Um, we can just drop this. We can drop both of these. And uh, we want to check on, first of all, it's empty. Okay, so get our, get two uh, drinks down. And let's move these out of the way. Okay, those are set. Those are set. Um, is there anything we can do while we wait? I don't believe so. We can prepare some rose hips for 15 minutes. Okay, so we got one done. Eat that. And actually can get this one on too. Take that. Eat that. Now that's at least got some food in us for a while. Pass on this. Get that done. Eat it. We got enough water. I don't want to waste time. The, the, the day is moving along quickly. Do not want to waste time. Um, this is ready. This is ready. We will uh, immediately drink this one. Why didn't that work? Uh, who knows? And uh, Thermos, the other one. Okay, so that's in there. And we will grab a torch from this. And let's see if we can get a nice one since we're not going to really be uh, uh, carrying about this fire much longer. Man, come on, really? Can't give me like a decent one. Thank you. Let's move. Yo. Oh. Crazy. There's a rabbit right there. Um. As much sense as this doesn't make, I think that oh no, it 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 saw me. Okay. Do I want to take him out? I think I do. He's really detecting me. It must be, maybe it's a torch. Okay, maybe I'll pass on this one. It's not like I'm going to go back and cook it. Oh, he's right there too, eh? eh we're going to pass on you. We'll get you maybe on the way back if we suddenly have to abandon this plan. Just because of time of day, like it's going to get dark soon and I don't even know where I'm going. I don't know if we're going to find shelter. There's definitely a truck here. At least there's only one way to go, so it's not like I've had to make any decisions. No. Yeah, I haven't had to make any decisions so far as to where I'm going to go. The temperature is suddenly pretty decent, too. Um, looks like it's going to be clear. If it's clear, I don't mind traveling at night. But who knows? Everything can change so quickly in this game. You know, I think the reason why it's so warm is pretty self-explanatory. It's because I've got shelter in this nice tunnel. Nice amount. Here, wolves, which... Unless they're timber wolves, then I'm not happy. But they're regular wolves. Honestly, I'll take one down and rip all the meat off of them. Again, we have to see the scenario. There's no point in getting a wolf at this time of night trying to harvest them up uh, if I don't have a place to go for shelter. So, um, and so far, the more I go down this route here, the more worried I get because it's further and further away from home. But you could get a fire going quite easily at any time, no matter what the conditions, because this cavern is going to be very sheltered from the wind. The sun is setting. Get a lot colder soon. Yeah, you can get a lot of shelter in this little uh, pass, though. 
I wouldn't necessarily want him to be trying to sleep here, though. That's for sure. Let's get this going. Okay, it's opening. It's about to open up. Mm, what is all that? It's definitely opening up. It looks like there's a bunch of stuff down there. Whoa. There is buildings. Okay, so we know where we are heading to. This is insane. They wouldn't want to be doing this in the blizzard or in the pitch dark. You could easily fall off this thing. Um, I don't think I'm going to try and billy goat my way down as much as I want to just head straight for those buildings. This looks... Uh... Oh yeah, this is incredibly dangerous to try. So I just got to keep my bearing. It's definitely over there. Okay, so that is incredibly dangerous to try. I'm not going to. I'm sure you can. I mean, you can build go down just about anything unless it's a sheer rock face, but I, it looked pretty sheer, and it was really high up. And, you know, one one bad move. I think I've got enough sticks for now. One wrong move, and it's uh, you're plummeting to your death. Don't, don't think that's the uh, idea of what we want to do. I really do want to get there quickly, though, but I feel like this is going to be a long way to get down there. Uh, we'll 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 do it though. We'll do it. I want to start burning my. Uh, what is up here? Is there a cave up here? There is a cave up here. Okay, that's good to know. We've got one place we can come and uh, fall back to sleep at, if we had to. We'll just uh, yeah, we better take these. Okay, so we have a, we have a, provided this is not a cave you enter. Um, no, it's a regular cave. Uh, we will take this coal for sure. There is a, oh, there's a bed even here. That's nice of them to do. Okay, there does not appear to be much else in this place. One more coal. Okay, so we have a fallback place. Um, if we really have to. We know we can rip back up this road and find shelter and sleep. Let me check this. Um, I'm going to transfer this out. We are going to drink it. Reset our torch. There's a car. Thank you. Feel like we may have quite the journey ahead of us. Hmm. This uh, ridge seems to go on forever. I can still see where I want to go to. Um, I mean, it looks doable. It looks doable. I don't want to risk it. I just don't want to plummet to my death. I mean, there's mountains that I billy goat down because I've done it before when I played... And I have, you know, Timberwolf Mountain, things like that. And I know it can be done. 
But there are mountains when you look at them, you go, eh, it looks doable, but you just don't know if you get deeper down just how, ew. you know, like, are you going to get to that section where there's just no way to, to do it? We might have to go back to that cave. I got a lot of energy in me, though. Uh, the wind is holding up. I'm not a, I'm not opposed to these night walks um, it, with clear skies. I don't want to run into a wolf, but at least the wolf will be normal here and the torch will hold up. I mean, provided the wind doesn't blow. Lots of condition. I think that wherever this is going to lead me to, where I eventually will get down there, it's really, they really want you to have to struggle, though, to uh, to get down to that zone. And then coming back out of it is going to be a horror show. Such a long, it's like a whole day. And we're certainly not finding food and hauling it out of there to back to Transfer Pass, either. Um, unless there's something I don't know about this zone where there's easier ways to do this. As I learn the areas, I will discover these things. Gotta warm up somehow. I do feel like I'm slowly descending, but boy, we are really high up. So I feel like that if it doesn't start to go down fast, uh, I have no idea. But I haven't had any choices to move down there. Oh. Fairly certain it's lit. Oh, now we're starting to head down. It's like an airport or something. It's where I'm going. I think that it'll be good. I think I can probably end up living out of there. Even probably better than Transfer Pass was. I'll be able to hunt stuff. Who knows what we'll find. Okay, so... We know we're heading to the airfield by going this way. And so I guess we will just keep doing that. I'm not burdened. And I'm kind of got a bit of a wind against me, but not a bad one. Yeah, we're starting to lose condition, that's fine. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I almost uh, missed this. Um, Junker's Paddock, okay. And you are worth investigating. We may end up have to, I mean, spending a night here is an option. Um, let's check the outside real quick. Yeah, spending the night here is definitely an option. If there's... Well, I have my bear roll, so like, it doesn't even matter if there's a bed or not inside. Um, we, can, we can definitely stay here. What is this? Oh, good. I'm not tired at all, though, so if the weather is good, I will keep moving. Honestly. Let's uh, reset our torch. I would keep moving, honestly. I feel like I'm getting closer to where I need to be. Um, I think we're just going to quickly check in here. Make sure... Oh, there's a workbench in here. A strange one. Okay, that's interesting. But there's a workbench. Um, got some soup. Okay, so we definitely picked up the... A little bit of food out of this place. There's a bed, there's a workbench. Not bad little spot, honestly, for a, a bit. Nice that they put it there, I mean, after walking that far. Oh, we got, uh, I don't have a pry bar. I mistakenly didn't bring one. I'm sure I'm going to find one eventually, but. Uh... Okay, so this is a nice little place. Uh, I think we're going to keep going. I certainly warmed up fast in there. It's not going to last. Oh, there's another. What is all this? Oh, my God. 
What the? Jesus, uh, is cold. Thanks for all the coal. This is like a... What is this? Journal page. Okay. This is an interesting little area. So I make sure I didn't miss anything. Alright. It's like a mechanics yard or something. Did I check this truck? Apparently I didn't. Oh, what's this? Polaroid. Okay. I don't even know what Polaroids are. I did check that glove box, though. That's strange. So I jumped in there. I only checked the glove box. Didn't do the visors, which is unusual. Okay, we're going to keep moving. If I can remember where the road was. Where was the road? I came in the... Okay, now I'm. I went the wrong way. Yeah, because when I saw this, I walked into the front of it. That's right. I thought I did. Is this it? Oh, this is it. Yeah, we came and we saw it there. Right? Like we were walking this way, and we saw it, or we were walking... Oh, we were walking this way. I remember the waterfall. Oh my god, I almost started going back the wrong way. Uh... Rabbits over there. And I have enough uh, travel food on me now, honestly, with all that stuff I just picked up to... Uh, and you know what? Let's just quickly check that food. Um, it all is good. I can eat these. That's right. Why am I even checking? I can eat anything. No matter condition. I can't get food poisoning. Level 5 cooking. So overpowered. Okay, so this twisted around. I almost feel like maybe it's heading in the right direction, this road. I assume that when it says airfield this way, that if you stay on the road, you will get to it. Now, this is a question of what kind of uh, wildlife will I encounter along this road. And, oh, the wind is pushing in my face. I think I'm going to start running. Keeping my ears open. I haven't heard any howls. I think I heard maybe one howl when I first got in. So far I haven't heard any howling. I have to assume that the road is... The right. Oh, come on. Stop with the wind. It's really weird. The wind's just slightly at certain angles is causing me to slow down. It's a really small wind. It's just annoying me. See anything. Again, I have to assume we have been descending. We have been descending. Um, so I feel like this road will lead to that airfield. It's just a long, long journey. Burn some more sprint. It is a long journey. Yep, here's a sign, and it's saying go this way. Um, then that is the way we will go. Is that a truck? A car or something? Yeah, it's got to be a car. It's a truck. Nice they have signs, because I would have not known which way to go there. Right. Uh-oh. That's our first wolf. Okay, it's this way, right? Yeah. Yeah. Get on of your bad self. You can follow me. If you follow me all the way to where I get to safety, I'm going to shoot you in the face with my bow. So I have food to harvest. So it's up to you, my friend. It's up to you. But realize that by uh, coming for this stroll with me is taking you to, uh, to probably be the uh, end of your life. So. I'm 
I, I don't recommend that you do what you're doing. No, he seems to want to follow me. Well, Wolf, I think we have a little bit of a journey ahead of us. Oh. Let me have a look. Where are you? What? Not an Aurora. I don't know why his eyes are glowing. No. Uh-oh. Okay. We are running out of torches, though. I better get to this place soon. Yeah, if I if I get down to my last one, I'm gonna have to turn around and shoot him in the face. Oh, I think I see stuff. Hey, wolf. Guess what? I think we've arrived. Nothing like bringing your supper with you. Yeah, those look like your buildings. That looks like a couple buildings. I don't know which one to go to. This one looks very big. The tower, there's, uh, there's a couple of them. I don't know which one you would want to go to. Um, I guess we'll try this one. No, oh, I think I've found a door. I have. All right, we need to, uh, let's do this. Just for posterity's sake. Where is he? Oh, here he comes. Okay, so, um, I need my bow out. Yeah. Nice miss. Unbelievable. Come on, Wolf. Ah, forget it. Forget it. My condition is too low to be screwing around with this. I can't believe I didn't get that shot. I actually tried to... I'm so used to now the rock having to aim. The bow operates differently. So... I, 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 I went to right-click and aim. And... It didn't happen. I'm like, what's wrong here? That's why I croaked. I'm like, am I broken? What's going on here? So we're going to probably have to use our lantern for this. The search. I, this is my last torch, but I made it. So that's good. Trying to see if I can quickly find somewhere where I can. Oh, there's food like crazy. Awesome. How oh, awesome. Bridges. Is there anywhere I can light up? There's a ton to search in here. Wow. This is what's the right idea. Come in here. Oh, yeah. Bathroom of some kind. Okay, so we got to get rid of this. Um, I guess we'll get the lantern out for a bit. So we can see. And figure out what we're doing. So let's go back a bit. I want to search this room for sure. This is incredible. Getting here. I made the right decision. Oh, my food. Oh my god, I'm so close. Huh. Let's start eating a bunch of this stuff. Yeah. Ugh. 
about right. Made the right decision coming here, I tell you. <clears throat> the salt here. Nope. If I had a light source. Correct. Thanks. Thanks. If I had a light source, um, I might have to go outside and start a fire get a bunch of torches to search this place because I don't want to use up this lantern. Um, I don't know if there's a fire, a bunch of stuff down there, if there's a fire pit. Let's search for that real fast. Let's forget about everything else and see if there's a, if there's any kind of a fire device. I will grab any food I quickly see. I'm not, I'm not going to really loot because I'm going to come back and check later. Um, is there a means to have a fire in this place inside? Because if there is, I'll do that and you make torches. Or uh, what? What? Where am I? Is this outside? Oh. Because if uh, if I can do that, I will. Um, the other thing is, I'm going to end the episode because it has been going for quite some time, and I guess the gist of this episode was arriving here. So I think we'll uh, call it there, and we will um, we'll continue in the next one. Have a great day. Hope you enjoyed the video. We will see you in the next one.